what is going on with these kids today i it, i feel like the crime is happening younger and younger and younger y'all what is going on a Dever man fatally shot a 12 year old who allegedly drove his stolen car a 12 year old boy was shot and killed last weekend by a man who found the child in his car after it was stolen the man who authorities did not identify reported that his car had been stolen sunday and told police that he had a tracking device on the vehicle okay via one of those apps probably like an air tag or like one of those samsung tags that you could just put in there and then it'll track it and they got some other kind of you know other name brand ones as well during the gunfire the car owner shot the 12 year old who then drove off in the car the release said the young driver was found by police about two blocks away and was taken to the hospital where he was later pronounced to be dead the vehicle owner has not been arrested while the incident is still under investigation all right they said that the police believe that other occupants of the stolen vehicle ran from the scene before law enforcement arrived so here is my thing like I said, things are starting younger and younger. You're 12 years old and you're robbing. You know, you're still in a car, Grand Theft Auto. I'm sure you had a gun. You know, that's usually how all this kind of stuff happens. One, they're getting these guns. How are these guns getting in these communities? You know, you know what this face means. All right. So we got these kids who are into gang relations or just into the wrong crowd. They're getting guns that no one knows how they're getting into the communities. And then they commit all these crimes. And it's like, okay, well, what's going on? And you look at a case like this, you may be like, oh, no, oh, no. I don't feel bad. I don't. You play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. The guy he's just minding his own business and you think it's okay to just go and steal his car many instances we have seen where people are doing this and you got these regular civilians i mean you're a regular civilian too but you got these regular people who they just they're like i've had enough of this i've had enough enough i'm tired of being the victim and here's the thing you may be like oh we could go and call the cops this and that, that and that well here's the thing cops are good after the fact and that is if and that is sometimes okay so cops are not always going to be there to solve every crime to be there to prevent every single crime that takes place especially if it's in areas where maybe there is a surveillance camera even though i find it so funny that <laughs> you got some camera play uh, some establishments like uh, you got gt ogre he hasn't made a video in a while but you had people like him really good camera and then you look at the body cam footage and some of it ain't all that good you look at some cameras over here and some of it ain't all that good and it's like hmm, we should be investing on better quality stuff but whatever because some of these cops uh, you know these news stations they be putting out these blurry pictures it's like can you find this guy it's like imagine me going like this having my hand over my face or even a pillow over my face and be like hey can you find this person what no one you can't find that person of course not you know what i mean you could barely see anything it's nothing but a blur you know what i mean it's like draw a picture of somebody and then lick your finger and then just smudge it all over the place and be like hey can you find this person y'all know i can't find that person you know what i mean but i get what they i get why they're doing what they do but here's the thing you have people who are just getting so tired of constantly being the victim nobody wants to constantly be the victim i'm just trying to walk out my house go to the walmarts and now i gotta worry about a ray ray and pookie coming over here and now it's a a mini ray ray i don't want to deal with that I just want to come home i want to relax i want to go to target i want to do my shopping and my stuff be where it's supposed to be okay because cops cannot be everywhere y'all whether or not y'all love the cops or hate them i don't care but i'm just saying they can't be everywhere okay and we got these ray rays who are just coming out doing whatever and they think that they could just keep getting away with this kind of stuff and you have people that are like i'm sick of this I'm not going to be victimized constantly. You're not going to keep taking advantage of me. Now, you have it in some cases where, yes, the person who's a victim ends up harming the other person, whether it's killing them or not. But then you have other situations where they do buck up and maybe they get injured, maybe they're critical, whatever the case may be, you know, but it's just... And I, I look at all of this because I see a lot of news stories about this kind of stuff. And I look at it and I'm like, well, 
what can what can be done to kind of fix this you know what i mean because we're seeing it too often it's happening way too much what can be done and my thing is like this where are these dang parents y'all where are these parents now they didn't say any colors in here but i'm black so i'm talking about the black community right now okay so my question is like this where are the parents at because you look and it's like well ray ray yeah his daddy been locked up the whole time and da 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 why are you locked up and why are you having kids and you ain't worth a dang you know what i mean what's going on so you're just gonna have a kid and then be like okay deuces uh i'm out and i gotta what no maybe you shouldn't be having a kid because a lot of time they want to be like man is he single mom is he single mom? uh i think that you need an egg and you need the sperm to make is that not how that works anymore no the guy has no responsibility anymore i guess i'm kind of confused as to why we are not seeing the fathers in the pictures now you may say alex 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 or you may be thinking girl systematic racism you know you got the black men who are being locked up blah, blah, blah. okay so black men are always following the rules it for every black man always following the rules black women always following the rules you know yes you can't help that if someone targets you but if you're having an honest living da -da 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 -da, no one can say that you robbed joe schmo if you weren't there and you didn't rob joe schmo okay but if you're right there on camera robbing joe schmo that's on you no one told you to go and rob him no one told you to go in you know harm a little kid no one told you to go and steal someone's car no one told you to go and do this now you may say okay well covid makes people desperate yeah 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 okay but no one is telling you to go out of your way to harm these people and to commit these crimes man the man told it the man didn't tell you anything you did it because you're selfish and you don't want to work you don't want to get a real job and hey when i say real job i mean whatever is legal okay you don't want to do it and you mad and you're gonna be like oh well but it's because of it and it's because and i you know no it ain't it's because you're lazy and you don't want to work you want to make that quick money oh it's quick i just made 500 dollars today how much did you make yeah but i also don't have you know gang members and other ray rays trying to kill me because of what i do you know what i mean there's a difference between that you know that's also why you have all these different rappers once they made it they're like okay i made it i'm good i'm good y'all and then they end up dead it's like well how did that happen oh maybe because you're hanging around the wrong crew still which i don't understand why you would do that considering the fact that you made it already if you already made it why are you hanging around these people why are you still hanging around the wrong crew in the first place i'm just getting so tired of seeing all these people and you know they want to blame other people like and why is a 12 year old not at, at his house i'm not understanding why are you not at home why is no one watching you where's the mama where's the grandma where's the dad you just have these kids and you're just letting them go out and this goes for both mother and father Y'all not doing anything to keep these kids together? Something has to change.